We all look like our family members. Part 2 Hello friends, how are all of you? I hope you remember that we had travelled to Gujarat with Tara and her family. Tara's chacha and chachi had been blessed with twins. They had all come to meet them. We had learned that few of our physical features were like our parents and sometimes like our relatives too. This is known as hereditary. We had also learned that we learn a lot from our environment too. Do you remember that I had asked you to think about any one quality or physical feature which is hereditary? So tell me friends, are your eyes like any of your relative or are you as tall as someone in the family? Or do you sneeze like someone in the family? Do let me know. So, let us learn through this video that are there changes in our body due to age and we shall also learn that diseases like polio are not hereditary. Let us go and find out what is happening in Tara's Chacha's house. The objectives of this video are A. To understand that there are age-related changes which take place in our body. B. To understand that polio is not a hereditary disease. Ramesh Kaka, can you please teach us some words in Gujarati? Sure children, definitely. Do you know? How many languages are spoken in India? Maybe 15 languages. There are more than 1600 languages which are spoken in India. So many languages. It is said about the languages in India that ghat ghat par pani badle kos kos par vani. Tara and Sonu were very excited to learn Gujarati. Let us begin children. I shall first begin with teaching you to ask how are you in Gujarati. In Gujarati we say Kemcho Kemcho Tara What reply shall I give Kaka? You will say Hum Maja Machu I am fine Hum Maja Machu Everyone started laughing on looking at Tara and Sonu trying to speak Gujarati The children learned few more words. Then Sonu observed that Ramesh Kaka was wearing a machine in his ears. He asks him what it was. Ramesh Kaka, what is this that you have in your ears? Sonu, this is my hearing aid. I am not able to hear properly therefore I have to wear this. I can hear clearly when I wear a hearing aid. Since when have you been wearing this machine? Since the last three years, when we grow old, our sense of hearing, sight becomes weak and then we have to get a checkup done. The doctor advised me to wear a hearing aid. Oh, is it? Do you have to wear it all the time? Yes, Tara. I have to wear this machine all the time. I remove it only when I sleep. When people start facing difficulty in hearing properly, then this machine is useful. Friends, have you ever seen anyone wearing a hearing aid? But I have observed a child in my school also wearing a hearing aid 
So can this disability impact any age group? Yes children, hearing disability can impact anyone. But with age, the possibility increases. At the same time, Rajni Chachi's mother comes back from the temple. Namaste Sarita ji, how are you? Rajni Chachi's mother's name was Sarita. She was suffering with polio. That is why she had to use crutches to help her walk. Hello, how are all of you? Tara and Sonu, you both have grown up. Hello, Hello Kaki. Kaki. Sonu and Tara were not able to understand why was Sarita Kaki using crutches to walk. Kaki, why do you use these crutches to walk? Child, I suffer from polio and the crutches help me to walk. When Rajni Chachi was born, I was scared that she would also get polio. But thank God, she is fine. But now, when she was blessed with twins, I wanted to go and thank God that the babies do not have polio. What are you saying? Polio is not a hereditary disease. You unfortunately had polio because your parents might not have vaccinated you or there was not much awareness then? <laughs> yes, mummy. Polio is not a hereditary disease. Polio is a viral disease which mostly affects children. To take precaution is the only cure of this disease. To increase immunity against the polio virus, a systematic and timely vaccination drive is on. Polio drops and vaccinations are given to all children below the age of 5 years. Nowadays, everyone is aware. Mummy, you do not be scared. My children Chotu and Muna are safe. The doctor has already started their polio drops and vaccinations. The polio drops are administered at birth, 6th, 10th and 14th week after birth. And then between 16 to 24 months of age, the children get a booster dose. Excellent, Rajni. Tati, you are so well informed about polio and its harmful effects. I did not know that polio is not hereditary. Yes, Tara. Sometimes due to lack of information and superstitions, it leads to carelessness, due to which dreaded diseases like polio is caused. Great, Rajni Beti. You are a smart mother. I wish my parents were as smart as you. Then I would not have had polio. Sarita Chachi, I have also made sure that Sonu and Tara have taken all their doses of the polio vaccination. When in my school, a doctor comes to administer the polio drops and these two drops save us from such a dangerous disease. Yes, children. Our government has taken a lot of steps to prevent polio from spreading. We should all try and help them in their efforts. Friends, is the Pulse Polio Drive undertaken in your village too? Please come, let us all eat lunch. Everyone sits down for lunch and chit chat together. Tara and her family will stay for a few days in Gujarat and then return. So friends, I hope you have learned a lot from this video. We learned that with age, a lot of changes take place in our body, like loss of hearing, sight, etc. We also learned that polio is not a hereditary disease. You all spread awareness about the correct information on polio and take part in the polio campaign in your village.